Hi, I'm Jade and today I'm doing a Craftably unboxing. Or maybe it'd be considered an untubing because uh, I have the new version that comes in the telescopic tubes. Um, I did test it out and it does change size. I'm gonna be using this all the time. Okay, I have a weird little pet peeve. I am not a purple person. Purple is not a color that I enjoy. It is what it is. Uh, but is it just me or does like 90% of diamond painting companies, their logo or, or design or anything is purple? Dreamer Designs, Craftably. I know there's other ones, so there's more than two. <laughs> But I'm just like, why so much purple? I really wish there was options of different tube colors, like even if you bought tubes by itself, because I really love the idea of this for travel and I'm definitely going to be using this from now on. But like if I could get a yellow, if I could get a dark green, can it match my um, Unimade tray? Just saying, just saying, craftably. If you sell these on their own in different colors, I will buy them. So I actually ended up uh, buying these when they were on pre-order. I bought two. So I have this one, which is a Jasmine Beckett Griffith. And then I also have a Jody Bergsma. Not sure. One is Magic Happens and one, hold on. And one is Darling Draglings 5. Now, I am a little bummed. I thought I would get this in time for doing the, um, JBG along with Emeralds and Fairy Lights. If you have not checked out her channel, subscribe to her. She is right here. She's super sweet and I really like her channel. Um, but I'm so bummed because I didn't get to participate in it at all because I think there's one day left and I barely got these like last week and I was like, there is no way I'm gonna be able to participate. And I'm so sad because I was so excited for it too. And this was my first Jasmine Beckett Griffith. And I thought, like I kept thinking, oh, it's gonna come. Oh, it's gonna come. It's too late now. It's too late. But I am still super excited about this, so let's head over to my table so we can take a look at her. Before we head over to look at the canvas, I do want to say that I have a buy me a coffee. If you feel like supporting this channel, you can uh, go down to the link below and donate whatever you please. If you don't want to donate, totally get it, no pressure. You could do something for free that would help me, which is comment or leave an emoji down below. It really helps my channel and helps the algorithm see that people like this type of content. And uh, since there's a dragling in this, why don't we comment dragons or eye emojis? Because the eye lip eye, I think that's like Jasmine Beckett Griffith's, Griffith's like thing. So you could do the eye lip eye emoji too. That'd be cool. So uh, let's get onto the canvas. All right, here is the tube. It says Craftably Diamond Painting. It has a little card that shows you what's inside of it. And I saw somebody else's unboxing and I believe you can pop these apart. Oh, I am not strong enough for that and I'm not about to break a nail. So let's unscrew this. I really like the texture on this too because I feel like you won't notice scratches or anything. I'm really glad they went textured because otherwise it would, I feel like it would look real musty real quick. So, oh, I forgot, they have special toolkits. Okay, so I'll actually show the toolkit because um, this time I think I care. Let's dump this out. Oops. Uh, basic toolkit with tweezers, thin placers, wax. I don't care about these. I'm just gonna toss those to the side. It has a little cover minder. I was really hoping I was gonna get one of those little dewdrop dudes, like that looked like little water droplets. But this ain't bad, this ain't bad. It's okay, it's just a little, not my style, but it's okay. I'll keep it and I'll use it, cause why not? This will probably be my travel one since like, I won't be so afraid of losing it. And you know, it's really strong and it has like, very wide magnets like they're usually not so wide and I like that because I feel like it won't pop off as easy and I do like the little container it comes in and then I got two washies a plaid and then a geometric flower so I like these I wonder how good of quality they are like I have a bunch of cheap washi tape and I wonder if they're gonna even like stick to my canvas because 
or I wonder if these ones will stick to my canvas because my other ones they pop off and they're from the Dollar Tree store so I'm not really surprised so I'm gonna put this away now we have the star of the show okay Oh, the stickers. Oh, these are big stickers. I'm going to have to cut these. Yeah, I'm going to have to cut off the number or something so that they can both fit on my containers. But luckily, I did just switch to bigger containers, so they should fit. But I do love that they come with stickers. Oh, and instructions. And then, oh, ooh, this has, and it has like a big sticker of the, what is it called? like a thumbnail image so that you can put this in your log books. I got this because it looks like my mom and I just think my mom's super beautiful. So why not get something that reminds you of your mom? And then uh, I think this just is a, yeah, this is just a, te uh, like a checklist to tell you what it has. Oh, this canvas feels the same as Mary's Diamonds, a homespun hobby and spell queen that's like how the canvas feels to me i wish they hadn't have taped it i hate when companies tape their canvases but i mean it's not that big of a deal i just hate it because i can never get it off yeah see how it has this like little fluffiness why why did you tape it just no tape please uh but yeah this is the same texture canvas as like mary's diamonds and spell queen and a homespun hobby a lot i feel like a lot of companies are switching over to this so you've probably experienced this before i'm gonna move these i don't like the way they look in the picture just shove everything to the side all right this is my first look oh, okay bottom to top bottom to top oh the dragon's so cute I like how I get this, even though I said I'm not a purple person and it has a purple dragon. Oh, she she's a lot bigger than I thought she was going to be. She is a... I don't check sizes because I'm an idiot. She's a 20 by 28 inch. I'm not sure what that is. I'm going to guess like a 40 by 60. That's what it looks like to me. I think her... I The one thing I like about Jasmine Beckett Griffith, Griffith is her eyes. I just think they're beautiful. And they always so show so much emotion. And these drills are resin, so that's super nice. And it has ABs. How many ABs does it have? Oh my goodness, this has three ABs. So I'll show you guys that in a second. I'm not used to getting ABs because a lot of the companies I buy from don't carry ABs. Sorry, I have allergies and I keep scratching my nose. So it probably sounds really weird. And I do like the little flowers in her hair. Let's see, let's scoot this down. That hand looks a little funky, but like, I can deal with it, but like, she funky. What's she doing? Why, why is that finger I, You know what? Let's just ignore it. I can fix it in post. I think I'm really gonna like this. And this is printed super clear, and I like that the grid is kind of a mid-tone gray, so I don't feel like it's gonna be super obvious if there's gapping in the light colors, which often happens. So I, I'm, I'm happy they went with a mid-tone for the grid. Let's look at the colors. <gasps> Dropped a water bottle. No biggie, no biggie. All right. Uh, I'm not a fan of some of these symbols. I feel like it's real symbol heavy. I think it'll be fine. I think I'll be able to see everything since the canvas is pretty clear. I just don't like having so many symbols. And there's 59 colors. I do think she's so cute. And the thing is, I've never really been a huge fan of um, Jasmine Beckett Griffith, but like I said, this one reminded me of my mom and I just had to do it to him, you know? All right, let's see if the ABs, or where the ABs go. Okay, right here, this lime, green on the edges that's where this ab goes gee there's a couple little twinkles in here which are the yellows not a lot there's only a few like right here not this big yellow portion and let's see where do the whites the whites are oh okay so there's ab's in her just this cheek a little bit on her nose some of her 
little eye glistening spots. And that's it for this. But most, most of the white AB goes right here, which I might add a little bit right here just to even it out. Maybe I won't. Maybe I don't want to make it look weird. I do have some pink ABs, so maybe I can add some pink ABs to just even it out because I don't like it not having it on both sides. But that's just me being particular. Um, but overall, I really like this. And I think the quality of the drills are super nice from what I can tell. And they are individually bagged, so if you did want to just work out of baggies, you totally can. I am not that girl, so I will be kidding her up. But oh, she is just too adorable. I love her so much. I just don't like that hand. What is that finger? I, what are you doing with that fingy? Okay, I'm gonna take you guys back up so I can finish talking about this and uh, yeah. I'm really excited to take this tube with me everywhere. I am for sure going to be using this constantly. I may eventually spray paint it, but maybe not because that might be a bad idea, but I do have two tubes now, so. I can do a project, maybe I'll paint her. I don't know, is that a good idea or is that a bad idea? Let me know in the comments down below. But I do really like the quality. I think it's gonna be super nice to work on. And thank goodness for resin drills. I'm like this close to selling all of my acrylic drill paintings. Not because they're ugly, just because your girl's picky. What, what else can I say? I'm a picky girl. But I do think this is gonna be super nice. Again, I'm just sort of bummed that it didn't make it in time for uh, Emeralds and Fairy Lights uh, event, but it is what it is. Craftably did like stay super upfront and tell everybody, hey, like they're running late and everything. So totally don't blame them, but sorry, Emeralds and Fairy Lights. I wanted to do it, I promise. <laughs> um, but thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, I appreciate you being here and I'll see you next time. Bye. Mm -hmm.